this time again for News Hour on TV Africa. The bulletin, obviously, is always live on DSTV Channel 362 and Go TV Channel 175. And we are always streaming live on Facebook at TV Africa GH. You can also join us with your comments on all our social media platforms at TV Africa GH. Let's take a look at stories leading the bulletin tonight. Ghana's COVID-19 cases rise to 5,127 as the country records 427 new cases. 272 were from the Obuasi market in the Ashanti region. Now let's move to um, a social interest story and a 48-year-old mother of two girls with disabilities at Mepe in the North Tong district of the Volta region is appealing to well-meaning individuals and organizations to assist her find a permanent solution to her children's disability which has bedeviled them for the past 25 years. Christiana Jekle told our Volta and OT regional correspondents Benjamin Makafui Atipo, that her situation has been worsened because of the financial constraints and the complete abandonment from her husband. On the 13th of March this year, the North Town District Assembly supported 128 persons living with disability in the district with assorted goods ranging from food items and corn mills to deep freezers pumping machines and computers while some of the recipients of the items showed great signs of happiness and surprise at the quality of items given others shared tears of joy with a deep sense of concern one of such beneficiaries who profusely wept at the event was 48 year old single mother from mape christiana jekle she received a deep freezer and an ice chest two bags each of sugar and rice as well as five cartons of tomatoes to begin micro food sales business her two disabled children Elnis and Achufi also received a wheelchair each from the assembly for their use Richard Collins Aku is the district chief executive for the area he told TV African news that the gesture was to help the disabled survive these abnormal times you can see the condition of the children here and these are the people that we need to empower to support that is so that we lessen the burden in her presentation, because of the condition of the children, the husband had to abandon her. And there's a single mother looking after this children, their family. She can't be go anywhere anywhere because always she has to be with them. And be with them, she must be able to do something that will sustain the family. She can't be go to farm because if the children are there, you cannot leave them unattended to. So I believe strongly this is the only thing we have to do. Look at the condition, we have the first baby they need be. And we can also to empower her the more. At least I have to put her in a very sound financial standing so that she will, go, she will be able to look after this children. Our news team visited Christian Jekyll at home later. While owners can walk and also speak a bit, the same cannot be said of Achufi, both of whom were born in the state of disability, accompanied with some strange rashes all over their body. According to their mother, she had been to the hospital all these years for medical treatment, but their efforts have yielded no positive results. Angels who really want to support you and they are all welcome. Because uh, together, it is a core responsibility of all of us who must also support this and the privileged children. It is not their own choice that they should be in this particular condition. One, they call themselves in this particular condition. And there is the need for us to give them the leverage, the support, so that they can also feel part of the society.